All right, everybody, welcome back to the nightmare that is my garage. So today I want to go over what are anti-shorts and what are they used for. So basically they're just this little circular piece of plastic and for commercial wire like MC, you just stick them, you can just slide it over the wire and then slide it down into the wire like that to protect the edges of the wire so that the sharp corners right here don't nick the wires and say it's the hot wire that would be a short and then it would just explode and trip the breaker nothing would work so a lot of people like to use these anti-shorts some people are 100 percent for them some people are 100 percent against them because when you go to put on your mc connector they do have most of the new ones have built-in anti-shorts at least the snapping ones so most people are either 50 50 whether they like to use these or they don't like to use these I was always taught to use these, so I'm pretty familiar with them, and it's kind of my standard practice. And when you go to put these on, like I said, you can just slide it over the wire because it has this gap right here. But I always make sure that the sharp point is not in that crack. I like to make sure that it is twisted like that, so this sharp piece of metal is on a whole surface right there. So that's basically what an anti-short is. It just is an anti-short piece of plastic that prevents shorts in your wire, like this MC. Um, and they come in little plastic bags like this. Um, they usually come attached to a roll of MC um, with either like a zip tie or just punctured through a little tie wrap. But they come in little bags like this. These are the ones that usually come with your MC. And there's different sizes. There's number zeros, number ones, etc. So the, this number zero is good for 14.2, which I believe this is, that's a 14.2. No, that's a 14.3, my bad, because it's got the black and the red. So that's a 14.3. Um, so this one is, the number zeros are good for 14.2, 14.3, which we have right there, 12.2, etc. The number ones are like for 12 twos, 12 th or 12 threes and etc. stuff like that, 10 twos and stuff like that. So zero is your small size, number one is bigger, number twos would be bigger and stuff like that. They have giant ones like this big for feeder wires and stuff like that. But anyways, that is the gist of this video. Hopefully it wasn't too terrible. Just a little quick video that I've been meaning to do for months and months and months. I will go over the MC connectors next and then from there we can go ahead and start wiring up some stuff back on the wall, making sure that I don't leave any sharp objects to puncture my tires. But anyways, guys, that's it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate it. I will see you guys back in the next one. God bless. Have an awesome rest of the day. Peace.